Use code WALLA for 10% off all advanced GG products. Thank you. With the recent shotgun changes, people might be wondering what is my favorite shotgun and what do I believe to be the best shotgun in the game? I tried using a lightweight for about a week or so after the changes and I know this role I have specifically isn't the best, but any lightweight is the exact same in my opinion. They just did not hit very well, they weren't one-shotting consistently, and they're just not worth using anymore. I still think if you really like it though, it's not the worst thing in the world, but guys, let me tell you, the Matador 64 is insane insane right now. I played a lot of games with it yesterday and I was actually really shocked by how consistent it was. I had one very consistent game I'm going to show you guys. It is ripped from my stream, so the quality is going to be a little lower, but I think it shows you perfectly how many different scenarios it one-shotted where it wouldn't have one-shotted before. It's an oval-shaped crosshair now, so it is a little different, a little wonky to get used to, but I promise you, you scope in with this thing and you shoot. If As long as you're in one-shot distance, it's going to one-shot 99% of the time. Some people might be asking about the Fractithist, and I've heard it's really good. I've also heard it's really bad, but it is the same thing as the Matador, but with Slide Shot. I'd imagine it's even better than the Matador, because it does have a Slide Shot, but I don't have one, and you can't farm for it. So if we're talking about what weapons you can still get, and the best shotgun you can still farm for, I think this is the one. And this is the absolute god roll I have right here. I would not change even one perk about this. This is perfect. So with that being said, I hope you guys enjoy the raw gameplay. I'm not going to cut it. I'm going to just show you guys some DMT and shotgun gameplay. Let me know what you guys think is the most consistent shotgun right now. I think Matador takes the cake at the moment. I, I still think they're not useless. I mean, I was using lightweights still and like... I I'm telling you, I switched back and forth. It was a pretty noticeable difference. You can still use them though. They're not useless. They're just not as useful, especially the handling department. That was really laggy, was it not? Slugs? Yes. Pinpoint slugs. They have a new uh, crosshair now, uh, and I think these slugs, when you when you hip fire them, I think they always just go in a straight line. Chat could chat could uh, confirm that. I don't I don't know. Chat, if you hip fire a shotgun on the floor, a pinpoint slug shotgun, does it always just go where it's where it's directed at now, or like what it, what changed with it? Or wasn't that like how it always was? I don't know. Damn, I thought it was cool. You already have uh, two red borders? Nice. Alright, wait, you can buy one, right? So you should, did you already buy those two? Is that why? I, I have not ran DSC, not even once yet. I'm too lazy, man. I think the first thing I do in a craft is probably the heritage though, as well. Did they give it opening shot? I don't think it had it before. Or maybe it did have it before. Does it have opening shot now? Um, um, bang, bang, bang. Shit. Nice knife. Like, look, okay, look at that one shot, dude. I'm telling you, it is the meta. I'm telling you it is. And I was sliding too. doesn't have opening I'm probably going to craft hipfire moving target it doesn't have opening shot mm, that kind of sucks I don't think it matters still kind of sucks though 
I don't think opening shot increases its one shot distance, does it? Anymore? I thought they, they, they like changed that. Three, two, one. Oh, at the wall. Uh oh. What the? I don't know what happened to skill base, dude, but I've been getting very newbie lobbies, feel, feels like. Is this how it feels like to play Destiny during the day? Like, seriously. Not, well, it's 9 p.m., but, like, not gremlin hours? Because I love Destiny 2, if this is how it's going to be. If I actually played a normal time. If it's Matador has opening? Yeah, yeah, I know Matador has opening. I'm using it right now. We were talking about the Heritage shotgun. Opening shot doesn't go above 75 range. Okay. Oh, that would have been so big. Wow, that was very, very unfortunate for him. I'm actually dumb. Why don't I just run into them? It hits max heritage? Okay, cool. So heritage doesn't need it. Where is he? Come on, jump! No! I thought I could climb all the way up there. I shouldn't have slid. I'm actually dumb. I lowered my head hitbox for him, and also I was in the air. We're just talking about the reworked weapons and what changes so far. Apparently Chris Proctor created the dungeon weapons. Okay. Anything like new or like anything like very cool or not yet? Uh, it's so good. Look at that one shot, guys. I know it's, it doesn't seem too crazy, but to me, I don't know. See, in the air, in the air, it's still bad, but that's normal. It feels like we're playing old school Destiny again with the shotguns. Like, I'm talking like back in the day. <laughs> wow, this is awesome. God damn it, I suck. I'm gonna go for heavy. You try to play more rank today? Yeah, big mistake. Big mistake. Rank sucks. Oh. I'm assuming you were playing solo queue as well. Just the icing on top to make it even more unenjoyable. goodness you know what i find myself i hit i'm finding myself hitting more headshots because of the precision frame as well My knife came out, I was suppressed. Interesting. 
I pressed it before the suppressor though, but still. Uh oh, <laughs> I'm shooting at the fucking floor. Damn, what a game. That was good too. But that felt like noob city, that one. Like just, that one felt like it was filled with noobs. 50. Damn, I should have recorded that one. I might have to pull that one from my stream.